Hey guys, President Bola Tinubu on Wednesday departed Abuja for France, a trip the State House described as a private visit. However, sources told Sahara reporters that the trip was for medical leave. President Bola Tinubu departs Abuja for Paris, France on Wednesday, January 24, 2024 for a private visit. He will return to the country in the first week of February 2024. The Chief Ajiri Ngarale, the Special Advisor to the President on Media and Publicity, said in a statement released on Wednesday. It is a medical leave because the so-called private visit is for the President to see his doctor in France, a presidency source said. Sarah reporters months ago reported how Tinubu, after the May 29 swearing in, became exhausted and went on a bed rest. Sahara reporters had also exclusive, exclusively reported that Tinubu returned to France to see his doctors week before his inauguration on May 29. He is returning, returning to France to see his doctors ahead of the stress of the inauguration period so he can prepare for his swearing-in, a top source in the ruling All Progressive Congress had told the newspaper. On May 1st, Sahara reporters exclusively reported that Tinubu visited Lagos to take a medical rest and see some of his doctors who had arrived in the country to give him follow-up medical care. It was learned that some members of the medical team who treated Tinubu in France were in Lagos, southwest Nigeria, to give the then president elect follow up treatment, which is the care, given, uh, the care given to a patient over time after finishing treatment for a disease. This involves monitoring a person's health over time after treatment. Tinubu had earlier. Re returned to Abuja, Nigeria's federal capital territory, after weeks of medical treatment in France. Although his medical aid, uh, medical his media aid, please pardon me, Bayo Ononoga insisted he was on vo vacation in France. Sahara reporters had exclusively reported that Tinubu fell ill after the March 18 governorship and his state assembly elections and was flown to France for medical treatment. However, despite the deniers, Sarah reporters also reported that Tinubu's ailment was so severe that for five days, while being hospitalized abroad, he could not speak and had to be intubated. Intubation is a procedure required to help save a life when the patient cannot breathe. It is a process where a, a health care provider inserts a tube through a patient's mouth or nose. They down into the, the treacher, hair, airway, windpipe. The tube keeps the, the trach open to that air so that air can get through. The tube can connect to a machine that delivers hair or oxygen. According to Cleveland Clinic. Common conditions that lead to intubation include airway obstruction, something caught in the airway blocking the flow of air, cardiac arrest, sudden loss of heart function, injury or trauma to your neck, abnormal abdomen or chest of that affect the airway loss of consciousness or a low level of consciousness which can make a person lose control of the airway others include the need for surgery that will make you unable to breathe on your own respiratory that is breathing failure failure or a temporary stop in breathing and risks for aspiration breathing in an object or substance such as food, vomit, or, or blood. 
Sara reporters also reported that Tinubu's tongue was reportedly stinking out during the time his condition were severe. Tinubu's ailment and health were in shambles before he left Nigeria to undertake treatment in a French hospital, a source had said. His sickness was so severe that for five days during his hospitalization, he could not speak and had to be incubated, another source had said. His tongue was reportedly sinking out, one of the sources had added. While addressing journalists shortly after his return, it was also noted that Tinubu had a suspected peripherally inserted central catheter PICC line attached to his upper arm. Pictures of him with the medical device went viral on social media platforms. According to medical experts, experts PICC is used to deliver uh, medications and other treatment directly to the large central veins near heart. Well, we wish Mr. President more uh, improvement in his health condition. We all prostrated before you, God, that you should listen to our prayers and uh, strengthening the, the President, Bola Tinobu, with good health. May you, God, see him through all his health challenges. And no foreign president will come to Nigeria for medical leave, okay? Nobody should pray to be allowed uh, to lead by this, uh, uh, this kind of president. So, okay, guys, these are some reactions from Nigerians. So, what's your take on this? Let's hear from you. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you.